Multiple rounds making their way into BC's coast as some ski resorts have been delayed opening due to a lack of snow. That all comes to a halt today. First system making its way in midday Thursday. Quite a bit of rainfall but also some low-lying snowfall as that freezing level is hovering around 250 meters. Second system right on its heels Friday morning bringing warmer temperatures in so we're still going to see that free, uh, rainfall but that uh, mixing precipitation is going to head further inland and into higher elevations. A heavy rainfall for the western coast of the island continuing into Saturday morning. Plenty of snow for the North Shore Mountains. Here's a look at those freezing levels. 250 meters on your Thursday, but watch as that warm air gets ushered in. Early next week, freezing level increases almost to 3,000 meters. Now, here's how much rain we could be seeing in the short term. Upwards to 75 millimeters on the western shores of Vancouver Island, north of Tofino, and plenty of snowpack to go along with it. Uh, those uh, Cypress and Seymour Mountains getting quite a bit of snowpack, as well as even North Van could pick up a stray flake or two. And some travel impacts along the island are likely along the trans Canada from Malahat down to Highway 19 could see some mixing along your routes. Now looking further out we see a Saturday night into Sunday quite an intense system with a lot of moisture gets ushered in as the freezing level continues to increase. We're going to see that mixing there in Hope and Abbotsford. Here's how much rain we could be seeing in the long term as the possibility of an atmospheric river becomes much more likely.